It's a quiet morning so far. We have plenty of 50s, some low 60s still found on the map. Some 40s elsewhere in Kentucky and a not too bad of a morning getting outside. A few of us made the light sweatshirt or the uh, jacket getting your morning rolling. But regardless, we're looking pretty good. 57 as we get the ball rolling here early on this Monday morning. And up to the north, this where some of the cooler air is pocketed. Uh, Lawrence County towards Jefferson County, Indiana. Stretch well into the middle to upper 40s to get the morning rolling. Shelbyville 55. Our friends in Litchfield at 53 degrees early on this morning. Des Moines, Iowa dropping down to 44 early on. Now this cooler air you see to the north, that is going to be upon us beginning tomorrow morning. And we're going to be dealing with another cool morning as we get into uh, Wednesday as well. But so far today, not too bad. In fact, for the afternoon, we're going to be climbing to about 71, which is about a good solid three degrees cooler than what we should be at this time of the year. But the patio forecast is bringing in some absolutely gorgeous weather as we get you into each and every day in our seven day forecast. Getting to 76 on Wednesday, 73 tomorrow and today, likely clipping about 71 for the afternoon. We do have a good little batch of light rainfall from Boston to towards uh, much of New England. England right now we're going to be steering clear of any kind of rain shower activity because we have a good old H overhead. You probably see this area of high pressure pretty often on quiet radar maps that a lot of us show as broadcast meteorologists. What's going on is the air in the upper levels of the atmosphere are coming together and then uh, towards the lower levels of the atmosphere that air is hitting the surface and clearing out. So that's where you do get a sunny sky and a lack of any kind of upward motion in the atmosphere and that's why we're not going to be seeing any kind of clouds or um, just chances for rainfall in the foreseeable future. So each day this week, bringing in a surge of dry air full of sunshine, and we're going to be steering clear of any kind of rain chances until possibly middle of next week. But uh, it's too far out to get a full detailed forecast on that right now. When it comes to Hurricane Milton, though, this is what all of our attention is on with the active weather. Hurricane Milton right now strengthening to a Category 2 hurricane as of 5 a.m. this morning, and right now the track of it does bring it just north of the Yucatan Peninsula, mainly along the uh, Florida Gulf Coastline, and actually all of the uh, southern portion of Florida will be affected. We have tropical storm watches and hurricane watches posted for the Gulf Coast of Florida as Milton likely will be becoming a, hur a category three and four hurricane as we get into the mid portion of this week. So please keep everybody in Florida on your thoughts as we get you into the remainder of this week. But us locally staying pretty quiet. Low temperatures will be in the 40s each day in Louisville until about Friday morning of this week.